I have decided, as per the evidence presented today in this court, that the defendant is innocent of all charges. Yes! <laughs> the court is the judge. Your Honor. Yeah, yeah, lunch to Longia to Samaji, the Solvio Manena, Sindio. So, in the meantime, let's go have fun, yeah? Allah. <laughs>
Somebody to just give me a hint of whatever is happening. I'm not in a position to be here. Seriously? Are you joking? My daughter is lying in an emergency room and nobody is giving me any information. Calm down. And you tell me to calm down? Really? Take a deep breath. Oh. Mr. Morgan, I have very, very disappointing news. What's wrong with my daughter? Um, uh, we've done some tests and it seems she was sexually assaulted. That's not possible. Well, we did tests and they turned out positive. That can't be. When did you last see her? Last evening. They went out with my cousin. Last evening. How old is she? She's 18. 18. Um, this this is now a police case because this is a criminal case. You have to conduct the police investigation. But until I know who has done this to my daughter, can I be able to see her? Not now, really. Please, doc. I need to see my daughter. Uh, well, 
just for a few seconds, eh? Please. So. Nurse? Nurse? Emily has got Mr. Mongrel to see his daughter. So. Thanks. So. By the way, will you fix a little home? Eh, no, I'll fix it. Yes, I wish to. I'm worried, man. She was best. So, I'm going to die. I'm going to die. But I'm not sure. 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 Eh, sa, all well and good. Let's do it quick. Hmm. Yeah, let's fix up the problem. Sa. Uh huh. Sa. Sa, my dad. Hmm. Ah, sa ni ko busy kaya si. Dada, papa dad. Ah. Dakula ada yang jadi kerja bash. Saya pun ada zahir. Tanda kami fanya delivery dan. Anak pun kami mana messenger. Jadi delivery ku anzam tu. Okay. That is all that I know. Mufitia tu sana. When I come back, it will not be as good as it is. I'm scared. Bye.
Lee, you can find a new tenor. Stop laying down. Some action look busy. Lee, busy. Busy, eh? Eh, who are busy? Then you talk to your kunya beer, you say, dear. If true, I say, man, I can't go up for the next few hours, eh? Where you'll have the pleasure to scream the way you want. Jess! Jess! Come! Jess, do you know? Do you know what is your responsibility? Get out. Talk her. What happened? Sidri? Serious. Dad. Ali talk and Ali is an adjunct. You trusted that bastard. Lijua tu. Usi mtu wa kuaminika hata kidogo. Nipe arusa wenda nani? Nuko unajua inaanza saa ngapi? Inaisha saa ngapi? Ama iko wapi? Fred, stop, stop. Ni mimi dada. Ni ni kosa. Mimi ni kwanza hapo na nani? Hata kama lisi mtu wa kuaminika hata kidogo na mbona hukuniambia mimi nilikuwa nda kusave trouble really acha tu ile zero tapet nakitaka Tulitoka kumunga saibu. Tukenda. Kani kuchia. Tukenda kwa kinari ufanya umashu. Tuka jibamba. Tuka kumu. Tuka fanya kila kitu. Venye watu walianza kutoka. Ndiyo. Mi wansha kwa super drunk. Ndiyo mwambia ni kile ni kwa rumu. Sa. Ndiyo ni tulingi kwa rumu. Naka fumbe mlango. Ndiyo kani. Li, Li ndo alikufanya hivi. Likuambia aje. Umtu siwa kwa minika. Umtu ntamvunja migu. Ata kuwa kwa kitanda kama ee. Ayi, dadu kini. Ata sasikia. Aja tu. Sikiza dadu. Sikiza dadu. Ayi. Azirishi. Did you take the delivery? Yes, I did. I got the office. 
Yanko was here. And he was really pissed off. Hakuna kitu umefanya dad. So cha stress. Uko sure? Uko sure kuna kitu umefanya? You know what they say, eh? Like father, like son. So please, please acha kunitarogate. Hi. How may I help you? I'm Mr. Morgan. I'm here looking for a lawyer who can take up my daughter's case. Okay, I'm listening. She was sexually molested and I don't justice served. Oh, I'm sorry about that. Thank you. Mm, do you have any documents from the hospital perhaps? Yes, I have some doctor's report here which you can take a look. I'll take your case. Thank you. Uh, but before you proceed with anything else, mm -hmm. I'll have to talk to your daughter, ask her a few questions. Um, not a problem. She's still admitted in the hospital. Oh, it's okay. And um, this is not going to be an easy case. I don't think I have an option so long as justice is served. Mm -hmm. I see you already. I don't have an option. Let's go see your daughter then. Okay. Hey, morning. Meet Susa. She's going to be the lawyer. He's my daughter, Lola. Nice to meet you. Such a beautiful girl. Thank you. Lola, we're going to tell um, Susa all that happened so that she can have the best excuse. What time did you leave the house? I left the house at around 7 p.m. Okay. When you left home, were you with someone else or it was just you alone? I was with my cousin. Your cousin? Yes. What's the name of his cousin? His name was. And did he seem a bit unusual to you when you were leaving? Uh, no. Um, Wait, no. Everything was. Until? Until? Um, until he took advantage of me. Oh, I'm so sorry about that. And um, did you perhaps see someone spilling something yeah. strange in your drink? Mm -hmm. um, the results came with negative. Mm -hmm. Should we try? Okay, I see. In this room that he took you in, uh, was it just the two of you or was that that party? Is it really necessary? Yeah, it's very necessary. I need to collect all the information needed. Anyway, um, with what I've received and uh, with the document, the hospital documents that you provided, I'm assured of a warrant of arrest. Yeah. Someone will be sleeping with cold cells today. So I'll try my best, don't worry. And quick recovery, Lola. I have to go now. Let me see now.
Are you sure of this case? Like I said, it's not going to be an easy case. But justice must be found. Okay. And she has to be present in court? Yeah, she has to be present. She's so that. I know. What was that case? Are you there with her with this? Yeah. You're supposed to be for yourself. Yes? Yes, ma'am. Go check with them, say the gate. Yes, sir. Yes? Yes, sir. If it's Mr. Morgan, don't let him in, okay? Okay, sir. How can I help you? Um, is Mr. Lee Monday at home? Lee... Monday. Okay, come this way. There are two people here looking for Mr. Lee. Who are they? I live in the gentleman. What did you do? Go back to your work. Yes. What do you want? What has he done? He's in the red. Sexually assaulting Miss Lola Jerry. My cousin. My own cousin. Ah, Jesus. Wongo. There's no way I'm going. I'm going to place him. 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 Anything you say will and can be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford one, one will be provided for you. Understood? Understood your rights? Dad! You know me well, eh? <laughs> so, what brings you here? My son has been arrested. So what has he done now? 
He's been accused of uh, sexually assaulting the cousin. Daughter to your brother. Mm -hmm. You're right. And I want you to be the lawyer. Okay, I'll go see him. Maybe you can see how to work out bail. Uh, that will be a bit hard. Until you have the first hearing session, no judge is going to grant bail. I'm sorry. I know you can work something out, so long as my son is not convicted. I'll see what I can do. Good. See you later, sweetheart. Okay, bye. Una filaji? Niko sawa ba transfer kulala. Ya, acha nini nikutengeneze kitu kula. So. Niko dad. Ah, dad aliona alienda kwa msuso. But by now anafaa kuongea kitu. Sawa. Simba mlango. My name is Linda Ochin, and I'm going to be your lawyer. So, mm. He did. He's worried about you. Uh -oh. Look, I am here to prove your innocence. I talked to the Attorney General, and your hearing is in two days' time. We have to work together. Yeah, because we must. It will be fine. Kai, imagine I came as soon as I had. Oh, you watch it? Hmm, I'm going to go. Lazima ni kujui. Alafu, mm -hmm. maji mina feel like ukuwa pevi juu yangu. Hii si fault ya. Zi, unajua iyo dengi kambash. Mm -hmm. Thanks, azinge kwa hivi sayi. Mkwa hapa sayi. So, hii kambaba, azinge kwa hivi sayi. Wale. Haya. All right, the court is in session. You may take your seats. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a criminal case. 
sexual assault that happened on the 29th of January 2021. The prosecutor and the defense attorney. May you proceed? Ready to proceed, Your Honor. Ready to proceed, Your Honor. Your Honor, ladies and gentlemen, the defendant is accused of sexually assaulting my client, Ms. Lola Njiri. This evidence provided will show you the positive hospital test results carried out on my client on the 30th of January. These test results will show you that the defendant is guilty of sexually assaulting my client. Ms. Linda. Thank you. Your Honor, ladies and gentlemen, according to the law, my client is presumed innocent and still found guilty. During this trial, I will prove to the court beyond any reasonable doubt the innocence of my client. Your Honor, I'll call my client to the stand. Do you swear that the testimony you're going to give in this case before this court shall be the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth? I do. So help me God. Ms. Uswa. Ms. Lola Jerry. So what happened on the 29th of January? I left home at around 7 p.m. with my cousin Lee to go to his birthday party. Is your cousin present today? Yes. May you identify him? He's the one seated next to attorney Linda. You may proceed. We arrived at the house where the party was being held. We celebrated with drinks and snacks. When people started to leave, that is when I was super drunk and I told my cousin to take me to a room to get some rest. That is where he took me, closed the door, and he abused me. Did your father agree with you going out with Mr. Lee? Yes, he did. So you're telling the court that he's the one who sexually assaulted you? He is. Your Honor, I have no more questions left. You may take a seat. Ms. Linda? Miss Lola, you have told this court that my client is the one who assaulted you. Yes. You have also told this court that you were drunk on that night. My question is, how then are you sure that he's the one who took you to the room? I know my cousin very well. But you were drunk. How did you recognize him? But... Objection, Your Honor. Objection of a rule? Take your seat. You may take your seat. The attorney, may you please take your seat. Ms. Lord, you may take your seat. The accused may come to the stand. Do you swear that the testimony you're going to give in this case before this court shall be the whole truth, the whole truth and nothing but the truth? I do. So help me God. Ms. Uso. Mr. 
Salim, were you present on the 29th of January? I was. Do you plead guilty or innocent to the allegation that happened? I plead innocent. But my client says you sexually assaulted her. Not true. You see, Lola is my cousin. I can't do that to my own cousin. Mr. Lee, did you take her to the room? Yes, I did. One thing you have to understand is she was very drunk. I was helping. Mr. Lee. Nothing more. You're under oath. I know. Do not lie. I know. And you know what I'm saying? I did not touch Lola. Your Honor, I have no more questions left. You may take a seat. The defense attorney, do you have any questions? No, Your Honor. The accused, you may take a seat. The next session will start in the next hour. Court is adjourned. All rise. The prosecutor and the defense attorney, can you give your final remarks? Your Honor, ladies and gentlemen, the judgment should be based on the evidence presented before the court. The verdict should be fair and just. Miss Linda. Your Honor, ladies and gentlemen, no concrete evidence has been presented in this court and no witnesses have been presented. Therefore, my client is set free and all charges against him dropped. Thank you. I'll give the verdict. The two sides have no proof and evidence to back their statements. I'll therefore give three more working days for more information to be collected concerning this case. Bail will be granted to one Mr. Lee, and the court is adjourned. All rise. <laughs> This is all your fault. Please take care of your client. He's harassing my client. Let's 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 Don't worry about the evidence. Hmm? I'll meet you all before the court hearing to discuss about the case and how you're going to answer questions of the defense attorney. Do I have to do this? Yeah, of course you have to. I have to go, but uh, I'll keep in touch. Thanks. It's, it's good. It's good. Surprised to see me. Although you can't be here. 
Make room. Why is the CCTV room? What do you want? It's starting to piss me off. And I'm sure you know what happens when I'm pissed off. Lead the way. This way. during this party. And I mean all. It's gonna take a while. Take your time. It's no hurry. I said delete all the backup that you have. I, I cannot swear you need to with your mom and dad. Do it. Not it. Good. Otherwise I would have reunited you with your parents. Good boy. Miss Lola, are you sure of what you're saying? I remember him staying in the room. We have played the CCTV footage. And it seems that he brought you into the room and left. But th that is not what happened. Please tell us how he could have raped you if he was not in the room. I am saying the truth. My dear, it seems you have hatred for your cousin. Is money a problem? Or did your father put you up to it? Nonsense! I believe in whatever my daughter is saying. This guy should be in prison. No! Oh, no. If anybody should be in jail, it's your daughter. After all, she's telling the court lies. Like father, like son. Oh, no. <laughs> Look who is talking. Silence! Please control your back. Your Honor, I object. She's asking irrelevant questions. Stop it, that was my fault. Please go on. Thank you, Your Honor. Miss Lola, remember you have taken an oath in this court. I am telling you the truth. You can see that she has no words to back up her story. The verdict is fair and just. My client is innocent. That is not true. That yes. is not true. Young girl, you cannot control your behavior and be thrown out of this country. You may take your seat. Miss Suswa, do you have any questions for the time? No, sir. Miss Lord, you may take your seat. I have decided as for the evidence presented today in this court. The defendant is innocent of all charges. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Your Honor! <laughs> all right. We can appeal. No, we cannot. Me, I don't want to do this again. Me, I'm not Sorry. Sorry. Lola.
ongele so ndaka ni what do you want acha tuongee no mr ki you said you will protect me na nimekuwa humiliated koti that duka sema nini justice will be served only is working a free man lola please do not lola do not kill kama ram Why did this have to happen? I promised your mom I'll take care of you. Mr. Jiblem, Dad, you've always been there for us. I'll go make some coffee. Thanks. I'm telling you that place was like hell on earth. Hey, my friend, I mean. Do you know how much it cost to me? Yes, I do. You see, that's your problem, Dad. Always concerned about your money. Hmm? What about me? You're so ungrateful. <laughs> if it wasn't for me, oh, wow. you'd be rotting in that wow. jail. Or so do you know? That you raped your own cousin. <laughs> So funny, Dad. So funny. I know the truth. And it is not pleasing. The fact that I hate my brother is the reason why you're out of that jail. Son. An illegitimate son that I had to raise. You have to spit on my face, then. Yes, I had to. And I'm tired of covering your messes. Dad. Don't forget, that's the reason why we're here. To clean up my messes. Samza. There. Where? I don't see anything. Exactly. No one did. Look closely. Where Lee makes, takes Lola to the bed. The CCTV footage has been tampered with. Exactly. <sighs> oh my god. You have to be extra keen to notice this. That's what happens. No one noticed. Oh my God. Thank you so much for this information. I just want to get this from my sister. We can work together and find out what really happened. Unfortunately, that's not allowed. If you try and for me, you still be touching the same place. Really now? Nah. If you need me, you know I'd find you.
is here. Are you on my side or what? Obviously on your side. But imagine, lazima bonge na buda ako. That cannot happen. No. Ono job da kwa nafanya hizi vitu zote juu na kupenda. Hmm. Kupenda. He lied to me. Stop being childish. I am childish now. Ebu, you utatoka na hizi story, please. Imagine stoki. Stoki adi mbonge na buda ako. Good. Hello? Hello, how are you? I would like to see her beauty, please. She is in the courtroom right now. Will you wait for her? Yeah, I can wait for her. Okay, you may take a seat. Thank you. Hi Nancy. Hi. Is there anything scheduled for me today? I'd like to leave. Yes, there is a lawyer who wants to talk to you about a case. Where is she? She is seated there. Follow me, please. Hi. Hello. Good. I've been given a day to the next trial. I may don't want anything to do with this. Um, it's like we're starting afresh. Uh, we'll use the same courtroom except the judge will be different. What happened to the previous judge? He was arrested for money embezzlement and taking bribes. Apparently, uh, he was bribed by Mr. Lee's father, so the verdict should be on the side. So what will happen to the trial? Will it be different from the others? We have valid evidence. Plus we have a witness who is going to testify. Who, who is that witness? Unfortunately, I cannot reveal that information to anyone. What do you say? 
Mimi ni don't. Ni ndeta simu bedroom. Sit let down. Are you sure about this? They won't know what hit them. What thing? Thanks. You may take your seats. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is an appeal of a criminal case, sexual abuse that happened on 29th of January 2021. I hope the prosecutor and the defense lawyer are ready to proceed. Ready to proceed, Your Honor. Ready to proceed, Your Honor. Ms. Uswa, proceed. Your Honor, ladies and gentlemen, the defendant is charged with the crime of sexual assault, which happened on the 29th of January. The defendant, unfortunately, was acquitted of the charges. Your Honor, under the law, my client was acquitted of all charges. I actually do not understand why we're here. Mrs. Sir, you are right. Thank you. As I was saying, the defendant was acquitted of the charge. But I have evidence to prove that the ruling made on that day was wrong. Do you have the evidence? Yes, I do. played during the last trial was edited. What? What are you saying? What are you telling the court? That's it. Your Honor, I have given the clerk hospital test which will show you that my client was sexually abused. Anything else? Yes. I have a witness who can testify against the accused. I object, Your Honor. This witness was not made available to us. Objection of a rule. May I proceed, Your Honor? Yes, please. Mr. Rio, kindly. Do you swear? that the testimony you're going to give in this case before this court shall be the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth? I do. So help me God. Yes, so, so. Thank you. 
Mr. Leo, yes. tell her before the court. Do you know the defendant? Yes, I do. Hmm. It seems that the party was held at the place, am I right? Yes, it was. Please tell the court what you told me. During the party, after everyone left, Lola must have passed out on the couch. She was drunk. That's when I saw Lee. That's when I saw Lee come in to take her to the bedroom. Lee must have thought I was outside. But I followed them. But Mr. Rio, why didn't you go to help her? The door was locked. Plus, Lee came out as if nothing had happened. But you could have come for the bed. Why didn't you? His father, Henry, threatened to kill me as he did my parents three years ago. And he was proven innocent. Young man, are you sure what you're saying? You and your son deserve to rot in prison for what you've done. I object, Your Honor. This is irrelevant to this case. Objection of a rule. Do you have any evidence against any father? Yes, I do, Your Honor. <laughs> Thank you, Your Honor. Thank you. With the evidence presented today, I'll be able to give the verdict. Next session will start in the next 30 minutes. Court dismissed. All rise. The prosecutor and the defense attorney can give their final remarks. Your Honor, ladies and gentlemen, the judgment should be based on the evidence presented in court today. The verdict should be fair and just. Ms. Linda? Your Honor, I pray that the verdict is fair as the allegations against my client are all false. I have already decided the verdict of the case based on the evidence presented today. The defendant is found guilty for sexual assaulting his cousin and therefore sentenced to 25 years in prison. A case has been opened for Mr. Henry for the murder of Mr. and Mrs. Njuguna. He should be arrested. Court dismissed. All rise. Shut up! Ready had your chance.
ce l'avevi con me? Ho fatto un festino! Uvi, basta!